Well, a very pleasant Thursday morning, and welcome to just a few minutes here with Sunrise with Pastor Hayton. I guess I'm old enough that I look back and I get a little bit nostalgic sometimes. I think about uh, a lot of things that uh, I enjoyed in my lifetime, and you know, I wish that I could kind of go back and experience those experiences again, or possess the possessions again. Every time I see a 57 Chevy convertible, I get a little nostalgic and think, well, that's the car that I had back in my youth, and, and I love that car, and even today, if I were wealthy, I suppose that you'd see me tooling around in a 57 Chevy convertible, just kind of uh, going back in the past, I guess, trying to experience, like I say, some of the joys and experiences that brought pleasure. Just one little example there maybe a, or nostalgia, but one thing that I really am nostalgic about, one thing that I really long for, that I remember, that I grew up with, and that is the old Sunday night evangelistic worship. You know, my dad pastored for many, many years, and, and uh, I remember growing up as a child, why preachers used to make announcements, you know, even though most everybody that was there they were there every Sunday, and they knew that Sunday school started at 9.45, and they knew morning worship started at 10.45, and they knew Sunday evening started at 7.30, and they knew prayer meeting came about at uh, 7.30 on Wednesday night, yet the announcements were always made, and one thing that my dad always said when he was announcing Sunday night service is our Sunday evening evangelistic service begins at 7.30. And you know, I thought about Sunday evening evangelistic service. I thought about, you know, that was the time that generally if the sinner was going to be in church, be more likely to be on Sunday night than on Sunday morning. And I remember the days, you know, when preachers would preach uh, an evangelistic, what we call an evangelistic, an appeal to the sinner, and sinners would be saved. And you know, not only do I remember the evangelistic sermons, the... Uh, the appeal to the sinner, come unto me all ye that labor and are heavy laden, I will give thee rest. Uh, there was a time that God winked at, at the sin, but ignorance, but now he commandeth men everywhere to repent. The summer is ended, the fall is here, we are not saved. And you know those kind of texts that the evangelists used. And yet they worked, and people were genuinely converted, and their lives were transformed by the grace of God. But along with the transformation of sinners, I remember the singing, oh, the fervor of Sunday night singing, just the old Sunday night songs that we enjoyed that were sung with such fervency and enthusiasm. I remember, you know, I don't have to tell you what some of those old songs were, but when the roll is called up yonder, I'll be there. And, and uh, you know, uh, the, these good old songs that have ministered and served the church well for so many years, I kind of miss the fervor of Sunday night singing. I miss uh, a lot of things in life, but one thing that is the prayer of my heart is that God might even yet revive the Sunday night evangelistic service. Now, I don't know how evangelistic it may be, but I do believe that we could uh, enjoy once again the fervor and the excitement of Sunday night worship where we sang the old gospel songs and, and preached with an appeal to people to be born again. I just kind of miss all that myself. It wasn't just the singing and the preaching. See, Mike, when church was over, people just kind of laid back and relaxed and the adults would gather together and, and visit a little bit and we children We'd run around the churchyard catching fireflies or, uh, you know, trying to corner the prettiest girl and talk to her or, uh, you know, play tag of some kind. Seemed like it was just a good time. And I miss Sunday night worship service. We have a little Bible study, small group study, and it's not a small group by choice, but that's just kind of what gathers. And I just keep praying that God will somehow raise up a generation that will revive the Sunday night worship service. I miss it a lot. Well, let's pray and ask God to revive all of us. Heavenly Father, thank you for memories that serve us well. Lord, for those memories that make us think back to perhaps what we think is a better time. 
We pray, God, that that would put it upon the hearts of people, us Christians today, to get back to church on Sunday nights and to invite our lost friends and family. Lord, that we might have preachers that will get up and preach the gospel with an appeal for men to be born again. God, we just pray that that will help us in our generation. We might be all that by the grace of God we should be and can be. We pray in Christ's name. Amen. Well, I just wanted to share that with you this morning, and we'll see you tomorrow on Sunrise with Pastor Hayton. Goodbye now.